Welcome to another session of mother to son cooking.com. Living here in San Antonio, tacos are one of the greatest things in the world. Most people will do it with carne asada, eggs, and whatever. This recipe I like because it's a little change in the scenery. Basically, what I do, I come back in and do a fish taco. Now, you can do this or not, but it does add quite a bit of flavor to the dish. What I'm going to make is a real quick, simple slaw recipe. Uh, as you can see, I've got about a cup of uh, green cabbage cut up. I just happen to have a little bit of red cabbage. It just adds a little bit of color. If you notice over there, i got a lime cut up. I've got uh, the salt and pepper, a little bit of olive oil over there, a little red wine vinegar, and a little bit, bit of mayo. When it comes to adding your spices, you can add whatever you want. The basic, you start off with the salt and pepper, and you can kind of come back and flavor it from there. The red wine vinegar adds a little bit of uh, tang to it. The lemons add a little bit of tang. And then what I like to do right before I'm ready to serve this, I like to put a little bit of mayonnaise in the, the um, slaw mix to come back in and give it a little creaminess. So anyways, I'm going to mix it together and I'll show you what it looks like. Alright, we're back about three minutes later. As you can see, I've kind of mixed up the uh, slaw with all the ingredients. I added the, the salt, the pepper, a little red wine vinegar, a little bit of lime, a little bit of olive oil on the thing. It's got a nice little texture. Like I say, what I like to do on this is come back and add a little bit of uh, mayonnaise to it. Adds a little bit of creaminess. It's not making a lot. You can always come back in and use leftovers for a sandwich or whatever and it'll keep the ice box two or three days. I hope you make this recipe and thank you for coming back to mothersoncooking.com. Now I'm going to show you how to do uh, the fish tacos to go with it. This just adds a little bit of spice to it. So thank you